Memorial Sites of Nazi Terror in Europe. Twelve Years of Nazi Crimes. Six Million Jews Murdered in the Holocaust. All in all, over 17 million people dead. Politicians, resistance fighters, war prisoners, civilians, and gypsies were forced into jails, deportation camps, and ghettos. Many were tortured in the 24 concentration camps and their over 1,000 satellite camps across Europe until 1945. Many of these places are now memorial sites in remembrance of the suffering of the prisoners and expose the biggest crimes against humanity. So far, we have photographed 38 memorial sites. From more than 60,000 photos, we have put together a traveling exhibition with over 70 photo exhibits, legends, and information boards. Now, a book is to be produced for international use in schools and other educational institutions. It will explain the history of the memorial sites and what is displayed at these locations today, such as the exhibitions and the historic buildings. It also serves to prepare a trip with contact information to the educational departments and study centers of the memorial sites. QR codes lead to videos for teaching and sharing on social media. About the Creators Maria Zarada, photographer, gypsy, and relative of Holocaust victims. Niels Oskamp, graphic novel author and survivor of neo-Nazi killing attempts. This project explains the consequences of anti-Semitism, racism, nationalism, loss of democracy, dictatorship, and war. To forget the dead would be akin to killing them a second time. Without memory, there is no culture. Without memory, there would be no civilization, no society, no future. Ellie Wiesel, Holocaust survivor, author, and awarded with the Nobel Peace Prize. We are looking for new exhibition venues, such as Holocaust memorials, museums, galleries, universities, and so on. The book requires funding for the media editing and to enable the photographing and filming of other memorial sites, such as Mauthausen, Majdanek, and Theresienstadt. Support our Remembrance Education Project. For more information and contact, visit drysteiner.com slash memorial dash project.